for sufferers of migraine, you realize that any time you have deprivation of sleep, they get less than usual sleep, they will wake up with a migraine headache. So sleep is not only your usual six to seven hours of sleep, but it also must be regular. So if you say you sleep at 10 p.m., let it be 10 p.m. every day because your body develops a sleep cycle. Other patients cannot do well with excessive noise and also strong smells. Dehydration. Fluids have also been found to be a commonest cause. If you're not taking enough fluids, and especially when it is very hot, that's another trigger for migraines. Stress, fatigue, exhaustion, all these are trigger factors for migraine. And as for you who sits in front of the television, you find that you're really, um, you get a lot of stimulation, you get a lot of exhaustion. The bright lights could actually trigger migraine headaches. And that's why even people who go out, the strobe lights are not good, they can actually trigger migraines for you. So for these patients, especially those who work in the IT department, data clerk entries, people who need their computers, and especially in this day and era of the COVID virus, where people are working from home and they need to be on their computers, they need to be online for prolonged periods of time, we advise you to take breaks in between. If you're someone who suffers from migraine headaches, which are the commonest cause, and there are very few instances, we tell you you can go, buy your aspirin, buy paracetamol over the counter, and use that. But once the headaches become a bit more frequent, and you find that now you're beginning to use painkillers on more than seven days of the month, you're running into trouble. So what over-the-counter painkillers do? If you're using them very regularly, they give you rebound headaches. So with time, these painkillers, they alter the way your brain perceives and manages pain. So you find with time, where before they would give you instant relief from the headaches, you find that now, after a few hours, which is probably one or two hours, the headache is back. And something else is that when you take these painkillers, initially, you'd find that the edge of the headache is taken off and the headache really just goes away and disappears. But now even if the edge is taken off, that sharp headache is not there. Your head is always dull, it's never clear. Every day you'd actually say you have a dull background headache. It's time to see a specialist or a physician or a neurologist because now you're running into what you call medication overuse headache.